Hi, my name is Emily Baptista and for SPL3 I'm going to talk a little bit about hosting. So, the definition for hosting is that it is a service that allows customers to store websites on internal web servers. So this is really an example of cloud computing because you're storing your website on another server rather than your own computer or somewhere else where customers or potential people going on your website wouldn't be able to find it. So places that you can go in order to use this service include godaddy.com as well as one in one. So I'm going to talk a little bit about web hosting, which is pretty much like renting a space on the internet. So when you go to godaddy.com or any other site that offers services for hosting, you are looking for a space on the internet to put your information, put your website, put the things that you want to put on the internet. So you're just renting a space to have all of your information. So it doesn't really come with like the furnishings of the website. So you get the space from a site like GoDaddy and then you have to create your own website from that already existing space. So for example, last semester in Comp25, we actually had to use sites like GoDaddy.com as well as make our own website from that so my business was called m sweet emporium so i sold things like cupcakes cinnamon rolls a bunch of sweets and stuff like that so as an assignment we had to go on to godaddy.com and find an actual domain name that we could use for our website so pretty much all we did was we go on there and you kind of type in a key keywords or things like that that you want in your domain name so people can easily recognize it or they can easily find it if they're trying to look up your site so since my business was called m sweet emporium i just put the keywords as m sweet emporium and actually i think i ended up finding a really good domain name that said M suite and forum so we didn't actually buy the sites you have to they give you the prices depending on how popular they are or maybe how in demand they are so for mine wasn't very expensive but we didn't actually buy them because it was a class and we didn't actually need the website but I just wanted to share that story because it pretty much tells you how it works and how you get a domain name for your website through hosting.